Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Pagey here, once again, with another video on The Flash Season 3. So as you may know, if you watched my most recent video, which I uploaded yesterday, on the whole Nang reveal of the mysterious black speedster that will appear in The Flash Season 3, the producers of all the CW DC Comics-based TV shows gathered and let loose on new information on their upcoming seasons. We will obviously be covering something from The Flash in this video, but there will be some stuff from the other shows of Legends of Tomorrow, Arrow and Supergirl in the next couple of days to a week. Now, I guess the best phrase to use when reacting to this upcoming news that I'm going to be talking about is, oh my grod. Yep, that's right, Gorilla Grod is coming back and in an even bigger way than we have seen before on The Flash. It was actually revealed at this gathering via Andrew Kreisberg, who is an executive producer on The Flash, that Gorilla Grodd would be returning in Season 3, but with a little surprise as well. He is bringing a certain location with him. Andrew Kreisberg gave us this little teaser to get us hyped for Grodd's return. He said, Yes, we're going to be doing a two-part episode that takes place in Gorilla City. So we now know officially that Gorilla Grodd will be returning, but I think we need to go back to the last time we saw Barry Allen or The Flash encounter Gorilla Grodd. If you remember in season two of The Flash, we saw Barry along with the rest of Team Flash use one of the breaches to Earth 2 to throw Gorilla Grodd back into Earth 2. Now this is where we got the very unexpected short but awesome reveal or tease of Gorilla City. This opened a massive, huge door, and a lot of people, including myself, were hoping to see it return, if not in Season 2, at some point in Season 3 at least. And that is what we are getting, which is awesome. One major thing to bring up though is Flashpoint. I'm not saying the two-part Gorilla Grodd story will be in the Flashpoint universe, mainly due to the fact that it is taking time away from the Flashpoint story if they do set it in that Flashpoint universe. However, one of the effects of Flashpoint when Barry returns to this, you know, normal timeline could be that Gorilla City is now on Earth 1. Then again, Gorilla City and Gorilla Grodd being still located on Earth 2 would still work. I actually think it would be better if it stayed on Earth 2. And the way that it all gets connected is maybe that Grodd figures a way to open one of the breaches again, but who knows. Either way, these two episodes will be awesome and will most likely be pretty damn expensive to make due to not only Gorilla Grodd CGI, but all the other gorillas and the Gorilla City itself, along with the rest of the CGI they already have to deal with, you know, with the Flash and stuff like that. One issue I saw brought up by some people around not only this news, but other news revealed at this conference was the amount of crossovers and the two-parters, and not just their quality, but its effect on the main story. Like, are they going to tie into the main story? Or we're going to get like a really, really rushed main story due to all these crossovers and two-parter episodes. I think it's actually better if they do it this way because they don't have to make it so spread out, the main story. I think the Flash Season 1 and Flash Season 2 are really, really solid. But you can tell at some points they are stretching the storyline a lot just so they can get through the 23 episodes they have. We do know that Season 3 of The Flash will only be 22 episodes, so they have one episode less to deal with. But there's still a lot of stretching going on there. So I think if they do have as many crossovers as they can, along with two parters that aren't part of the main story, it will actually make an even better season, because you're constantly entertained every single episode. Obviously there might not be as much detail, but there is still 22 episodes. I'm sorry, but if they can't fit a lot of detail in those 22 episodes, then I don't know what to do. But thanks for watching guys, leave your opinions in the comment section below. Are you hyped for Gorilla Grodd's return? Are you excited to see Gorilla City? Because when it got revealed last season, I got really, really excited and it's finally coming to life on our screens in Season 3. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you are new. I'll catch you later guys, and goodbye.